Okay, so I'm I have this iMac G5 that I've taken the back panel off, as you can see here. Um, and the way you do that is I just there's right here. You see the two screws. There's like two little mounts here. There's a screw on the bottom of the iMac right above the base here that you loosen and it loosens up those screws and you could lift that up from the back as you're laying this on the back. Then you can pull these pieces out from the top and lift it up off the back of it. So I got that off. The problem I had is the hinge here is very loose. As you can see it's it doesn't hold it up. So what I want to do is repair that, make it a little firmer so that it'll hold hold the uh, iMac up firmly. Okay, the next thing that I did is I located the right, um, I have a precision screwdriver set and I got the right Torx uh, fitting so I could take off the four screws that are on here. And on the other side here, there's another set of screws that hold the hinge down. So I'm going to, uh, you can see them right, right here. I'm going to take, take that off. Then I'm going to see if I could tighten it up. Okay, now that I've got the screws out, and they are pretty small little screws, so you want to keep track of those. But you want to, um, the cover for the hinge simply lifts off so that's the hinge cover and then you can see in there that there's like a, a clutch there those spring clutches right here and here so that's what we need to tighten up okay so I've got the, the uh, back of the iMac standing up you can see it all here and what happens is when you put the um, the, the computer back on the back uh, support here it just goes down like this and it won't stay up the springs have gotten loose over the years those two retaining springs so I don't really care about adjusting it I just want it not to droop down so my solution simply is to find something to stick in here so it won't move and it just stays up so I found this little um, wall mount plastic piece that fits right in there. So I'm just going to stick that in there. And now it won't move. So it'll be stuck in this position that I want it to be in. So I'm going to put it back together and um, try it out. Okay, now it's time to put the, um, the stand and back support back onto uh, the computer the iMac computer and you can see up here there's the little catches here that go onto the top of the back mount and there's also on the sides here there's these little hinge or catches that slide into the back on each side there's some, two more over there so we got to put those in and then finally this little mechanism right here attaches to the bottom. This clamps down as you screw this little screw in. It clamps down on the bottom to hold it together. So we're going to do that then I'll show you the results. So I've carefully inserted the top little slots there into the top of the back mount here. And then I'm sliding these pieces into their places. You can see that right there where that one piece goes in. So I'm going to drop that down. And then under here, I'm going to tighten that up, and we'll see how it works. Got it all mounted back up again, and it's no longer flopping down, which is the excess, success that I wanted. So now it's standing upright the way it should be. I can't adjust it to look down anymore, but I think it'll be good for my purposes until I get to the point where I feel like I want to order a new mount and put it in. But for now, I think that's going to work great for me. Hope this helps.